All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Monday. That means that we are playing some gimmick puppets. So I know a couple of you guys are back in school. Well, welcome back. Welcome back. I, on the other hand, never left. And that's it. I mean, the title of this uh, video. So uh, as you guys know, summer over summer break, because summer break is over pretty much, uh, I have been working my ass off at my, uh, my university, my accelerated program to become a teacher as quick as possible. And God fucking damn it, has it been the struggle that time, you know? These struggles. Wow. So he's just gonna go ahead and bust it out already, you know? I mean, the pendant mechanic's not dead, it's just, you know, I mean, she's still good, but this is lowered a little bit, this is lowered a little bit, everything is lowered just a little bit, you know? The pendulums, they definitely took a hit. So. Well, I literally could just throw the freaking gamma seal at him. Like I really could. So, I mean, what can I what can I pull off right now? What can I pull off right now? I could go ahead and throw the gamma seal on top of the oath dragon. Hear me out. Hear me out. No, no, no. Cause he he might top deck a, a is that pendulum monster or a spellcaster? We have another magician card. Are you a magician? No, you're magical, so you're not a magician. I could set the gamma seal on his side of the field, right? Then I can go ahead and, no, wait. I was thinking maybe can I possibly pull off a rank eight, but I'm not sure, I'm not sure. I could pull off like a rank, I could pull off like a rank four. I can go in like Utopia, Utopia Lightning or something or Castell, put this back in the extra deck. Cause I want to get rid of this. Yeah, I want to get rid of this so I can s warning him if he doesn't draw anything. So I'm thinking, cause can I possess that both per turn? You can target one gimmick, how can you troll gain the levels? Alright. I thought I, it'd be nice if I drew the one that you can, uh. You can special summon from your hand if you have another gimmick puppet, but I didn't draw him, so. Rip on that. So this card is the most special summon. I can special summon one gimmick puppet from my hand. I think I want to special summon you. So I think I'll send you, then revive you with, uh. With gimmick puppet, what's it called? Also, I want to special summon this gimmick puppet on your side of the field, and then castell this, right? Because it's just, it's just, uh, hundred monsters you control, can't be blah, 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 blah. And then hope and pray that he doesn't get a, uh, hope and pray that he doesn't get a magician to pitch. If he doesn't get him pitch and pop, then I can hit him with that solemn warning when he pendulum summons all of this, and he'll be, you know, shit out of luck, so I'd be totally fine. But if not, then fucking rip on me, right? Rip on me. And this Glacial Sky can't be destroyed battle period, so that's nice. I think I'll just go ahead and go into... Actually, I think I should go into Utopia the Lightning. Because this can attack over my Castell, and I don't want him to attack over my Castell with it. But then I would be leaving that 20... that 3,000 booty there. Like, I think I'm just gonna go into Utopia, Utopia the Lightning. Then he won't draw into a Magician, which means that he won't be able to pop my Solemn Warning. He'll commit to the Pendulum Summon, get hit with the strike, I mean, with the Warning, and he'll just be crying. You know, that's what I'm hoping for. This is this is, this is is Daniel's uh, convoluted plan to deal with a fucking Pendulum-based deck. You know, if I don't deal with it, then who will? <laughs> but yeah, I never left. I never left. I was still in school. Uh, I just completed one more class. I just completed the fourth course. I had a handful of courses. I'm almost done with the education part. I think there's six education courses. And then I get to go to math, because I'm going to be a math teacher. Yay, math! Because, holy shit, just sitting here and fucking dealing with, um, dealing with, uh, education courses, just kind of, yeah. So, I just finished the fourth. The fourth? Oh my god, that, that class, that course was a pain in the dick, ha. Huh? Oh, wait, you, you drew into a magician? Wow, you actually drew into a magician, and you decided to, oh, instead overextend and run into this warning. Good job. Good job. Good job. That was totally bait. You totally fell for that. Turn this to defense mode and sit there quietly. GG. Yeah, yeah. Like, if, if I if I had one single set and I drew into a magician, hell yeah, I would do... Oh, no, because you can't use it because you didn't have a magician. You had magical. I keep for addition, this isn't magician. This is just magical abductor, not magician abductor. So you couldn't even use your effect. Over, you know, and overextended with that pendulum summon and then got hit with the warning, baby. Whoo! That's how you handle pendulum. <laughs> like, you're like, what are you crazy? Why are you gonna get him seal the fucking oath dragon? So it goes back to your tricks. And when he pendulum summons, I hit it with a good, good warning. Like, oh my god, that was good. All right, let's get another duel. Bear back. All right, we got another duel. 
But yeah, like the class, the last class I was in by myself, there were supposed to be two students, he never joined, so it was literally just me. And then I tried to interview one of my teachers for the, one of the assignments, and the teacher never emailed me back, so I ended up emailing my professor about shit from the class. It was, it was bad. It was bad. <laughs> but, uh, oh, Red Eyes. Alright, so, Triple Alert Darkness, let's go. Like, we already know. Triple Alert Darkness, that's fucking crazy. Pot of Cupidity? Alert Darkness? Man, this man is not playing, I'm also playing Pot of Cupidity. That's why my deck is larger than it would usually be. Oh, wow, dude, this man is straight up just trying to fucking burn me with the good good. Uh, I mean, you're useful, you're useful, you're useful, you're useful. That's the problem. Well, if I go into this, I can always grab it back. Like, Alright. Got me some more kaiju action, so that's fine. Wow, and then he surrenders. He's like, oh, I didn't get the OTK, I quit. Like, wow. Alright, alright, alright. Very bad. So... The class was, uh, and it ended with a fucking test, and that test was probably the hardest, most uncoherent test I've ever taken in my entire life. And I'm a 22-year-old man, alright? Like, I shit you not, this fucking test, this fucking test, this test, this test right here, nigga, this test, this test right here, nigga, it was like, oh, read chapters 13 and 14 of this book, okay, read the introduction and chapter 9 of this book, okay, the test will be on this chapters. I straight up read everything. Well, I, I, didn't, I didn't read everything. Fucking Rennie can speed read, so he sped read everything. And then after, after he said read everything, took the test, it was 28 questions hour long, right? There was like barely any. I'd say out of those 28 questions, maybe like three of them were from the reading. Outside of that, nothing. Google search, nothing. It was it was just terrible, man. It was just fucking terrible. Like, I, I've never experienced one of the, like, the, like a terrible ass test like that. So... Uh, if anything, we can kind of get set up, so that's nice. So I'm running pot in here, so I think I'm going to go ahead and foolish everything I want to foolish first, and then I'll go ahead and play pot and shit. Uh, and we'll go ahead and send you, we'll send my jury doll. That's nice. So I can summon jury doll back, but there's nothing I can do. I, keep, I never get that fucking gimmick puppet that you would like to special summon, so I'll just go ahead and activate pot of desires. Oh, there he is. There he is. See? 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 The power, the power, so we're gonna and just summon. Oh, I, ban I forgot I had to banish. I thought I could just special summon it. Nope, 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 you have to banish. Oh, and this has, I put my opponent has control of monster. Wow, I'm just, I'm just misplaying all over the fucking place. Oh well, oh well, like wow, that was, that was really bad. That was really bad. I forgot your opponent has to control a monster. I didn't think that out at all. Maybe I can go ahead and protect my card with a solemn strike and then summon this. Maybe. That was bad. That was bad. I was thinking I was like, I was like, oh, this, special summon this, special summon this, go into like a uh go into like a rank eight play. Alright, special summon Cyber Dragon, that's fine. I'd say I want you to I want you to go into a little bit more. I mean obviously it's infinity dot deck, so you gotta go ahead and summon that Panzer Dragon, go into that Nova, go into that infinity, so I mean, why not? Why not? I'm not gonna never strike this, because they might have that fusion in there. Then you go into that infinity, and you're just moving your cards all over the place to catch a strike. Gone. I said, he ain't done. He ain't done. You have a cyber dragon, that means you get to add galaxy soldier. Oh, or just another cyber dragon. Yep. He's yeah. done. So I think it's, he hasn't even normal summoned yet. Like, this is infinity attack. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, scoop it up. Of course, of course. Infinity, stop your infinity, infinity. Like, that's so stupid. Be right. Ugh, probably one of the fucking most brainless decks in Yu-Gi-Oh. Infinity dot deck. Really, it's just completely brainless. It's just, you go into infinity, you go everything in your, and everything possible to go into infinity. So brainless. <sighs> so, the test, I was like, I was like completely fucking lost on that shit. Uh, I mean, something in the hands, okay. I think I'm gonna go ahead and trade in you. Trade in you, draw into you. Uh, I mean, I really can't do anything. Like, you don't you don't control a monster. If you control the monster, I could do this play. So I think I'll just go ahead and take it slow. I got my rank up card. I got my uh, 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 interrupt slumber. So overall, it's not terrible. Wow, is he really not gonna do anything? Like, I, 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 I just don't have anything to do right now. Like, that's the thing. I, I mean, I could summon this and then 
doing Tokyo for 100. Like, what the fuck does that do? I really I have nothing right now. So I kind of need to wait for you to do something before I can do something. Once you do something, I can do something. Royal Decree. Okay. I. It's not a trap. <laughs> it's not. It's a trap. No. So the test was just a pain in the deck. Uh, I think I failed it. <laughs> he the teacher. And she was like, oh, thank you for being so honest. Uh, I didn't make the test, so I'm just going to go ahead and drop it. As a, you know, as a, as an assignment. Like, oh, cool. So she just straight up dropped it. Uh, so it didn't count, which means that I kept my 100%. So that, that's awesome. That's awesome. So yet another class uh, finished. Wow, we are, we are just, I don't even know what we're doing in this duel. The sad thing is that I, 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 I can't really do anything. Like, I guess I'll go ahead and send my, uh, this card now. Like, next turn I can, I can do something. One, two, I can banish this, summon this, normal summon this, make that an eight and go into a rank eight play. Like, next turn I can do something. Wow, this entire time it was trains? Really? Really? I did not know. <laughs> this entire time it was fucking trains, people. Like, holy shit. You know, take an extra fucking slow, extra fucking not doing anything for turns on turns on turns. Like, I can't do shit until you do shit. Right. So, I got the max C, so I could possibly draw a couple of cards off of that. So that's nice. What? And then he does nothing. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> All right. Like that's not gonna piss me off. Uh. So I could summon my Humpty Dumpty. Humpty Dumpty summon him, make him four, and go to a rank four play. I can go into like. I can go into like your guy next. Get another search. Yeah, I can get a search. Oh, I could cast Del. I think I might want to cast Del his fucking revolving switch guard. Because I don't want him to go fucking crazy plus off of every single little thing that I do. I mean, I, I don't want him to keep searching. Because obviously, he would have busted out of Dora if he had it right now, but he doesn't, so. And at least he has Royal Decree, so I don't have to worry about back row. That's nice. I'll go ahead and summon you. I'll make you four. It doesn't say I can only special summon gimmick puppets or machines or anything like that. No, uh, there's only the fact that Humpy Dumpy wants to return, blah blah blah, so, yep, I'm just gonna go into, uh, Castell, spin your shit, spin your, uh, revolving switch yard. The, the whole World of Cree thing, I don't mind too much, I have a couple of traps in here, I have, like, uh, Triple Reckless and the Solemn Brigade, outside of that, there's really no traps in here, so. So that can go away, because it, I mean, in your six cards, you should just bust that out of the door, like, I don't know what you're thinking, t taking it slow, like, really. What the fuck are you thinking? Like, you should be all over kicking my ass right now. All over beating my ass. Like, I thought you were gonna summon, special summon, Xe and Adora. I was like, at least I'd get to drop Maxi and draw two cards. Like, that'd be nice. Maxi ain't terrible. So I got 100% on that class. And then, like, immediately, oh my god, we're both playing under an uninterrupted slumber. But that's fine. That's fine. We're both playing it. We're both playing the fucking kaijus and shit. You did that backwards. Yeah. Yeah. You first. You first. Then me. Yeah. I made the same mistake first time I played that card. Same. Same mistake. <laughs> it's not how it's on dev pro, like... <laughs> I mean, he still has the fucking train combo, but this would have been pretty nice. Like, this and trains, jizz? <sighs> I mean, he's still okay. He can, he can like, make a door or something. Like, I don't have any of my kaijus, so... Maybe I'll draw into it. Or something like that. Alright. I was just gonna use it to pop. Yeah, yeah, and then you messed up, and I did that before too. You detached, you made me unaffected, and then you didn't do their crane effect. Like, wow, like, who doling dolphin. Who you, you seriously fucked up. You might have had something too. All right, be right back. Ooh, it's good that I pause and try to get a different duel, because sometimes it takes me forever to get another duel. Holy shit. Anyway, I get no break. Literally, the class, the last class finished on Saturday. I finished my last homework and everything. Oh, it's good. It's good.
Maybe. Yeah, yeah, he just threw this in. Yeah, that's blue eyes. Definitely blue eyes. Uh, of course, of course we're facing blue eyes. Why wouldn't we be? Everybody in the middle is playing blue eyes. Yep. I gotta face down two alternatives. Oh, or just spirit. Like, alright, well, this should be, this should be fun. <laughs> Fucking top tier meta shit right here, people. Well, I could just hit him with the uninterrupted slumber and he can't do shit. Like, even if he tags out, he's still getting fucking caught with the dark hole, so... And then that's gonna go ahead and summon. So, yeah, I'm definitely gonna, uh, slumber you. You're gonna, I'm gonna put you to sleep, nigga. Fucking kaijus are so good right now. Like, holy shit. Like, yeah, right now, maybe, maybe just in general. Like... Oh, I can't special summon two monsters. Rip, rip, I can't special summon two monsters. Wow, wow, so I can't even play fucking slumber because... This guy is like, nah, you can't summon. Like, okay. Okay. Wow. Because technically I would be special summoning two monsters, but I can't, so. Thanks, spirit. <laughs> Thanks, spirit. Fucking asshole. <laughs> uh, Alright, trade in. Got this. This is the one that copies the level. Uh, copies the level. I thought I might be able to bust out a fucking... Give me a puppet. It really depends, because I can go ahead and use you. Send my doll, banish my doll, summon. No, because I need I, I would need to use my normal summon for you. Really, I just need to get more fucking gimmick puppets in the graveyard. The normal summon you. Like, wow, this sucks. I can't play inter uninterrupted slumber. That'd be so fucking good right now. Please let me draw into a fucking kaiju. Please let me draw into a fucking kaiju. No, my luck, I probably banished all my kaijus. I banished one, so chance of me drawing into one is pretty decent. Got to run my rank up cards too. Oh my God damn it! I definitely know that fucking gimmick puppets won't be top tier or shit. But no, I'm immediately thrust into the next class. So Monday today, I'm already in my next class, my uh, my fifth class. And uh, <laughs> I I, seen, I saw the fucking teacher who was teaching the course, and I was like, fuck, it's Daniel. You're probably like, oh, what does that mean? Like, your name is Daniel. What? What? Dan no, no, no. Daniel. Daniel. His last name. He was my professor for class three. So it's literally three him, four different professor, five him again. And this course looks like it's gonna be harder and more of a pain in the ass than the fucking the previous course. Like, like, yay! Fuck me! Fuck me! Of course, there's already Kaju on the field, so I can't play that card. Uh, but at least I got another trade in, so I could trade in another monster. And now, now I can go ahead. So, if your opponent controls a monster, I like control the gimmick puppet. So, I could do this, do this play right now. Which would be nice if I had my rank up card. Look, I'm trying to think. Oh, I could go into. I guess I can go into gimmick puppet strings. No, I can go into. Uh, what's his name? I can go into him. So up to twice per minute, tied to turtle, then target a special summon monster. Opponent controls, destroy it, and then you see monster for damage. But it won't be an see monster, of course. So, so. The normal summon this, special summon this. Yeah. So I can I can get rid of both his monsters, so that's nice. It's just it's just Especially with fucking uh what's his face? Fucking shrine. I I'm still facing goddamn blue eyes, so I'm still gonna get it. So it's still still gonna be a pain in the deck. Yeah, yeah. So this one I'm gonna go into would be Gimmick puppet motherfucker. So I can uh, use my effect up twice per turn. So I can detach blow up that kaiju I gave you. And then I can detach and blow up that blue eyes. Even though you can be like, oh, you blew up my blue eyes. Let me go ahead and activate keeper. Keeper will summon back, give me my blue eyes. Then I can use this as two tribute and uh, uh, have another alternative target. Like, I'm fucked either way. Like, <laughs> me trying to face down blue eyes? Like, are you fucking, are you clinically insane? Like, this deck is nowhere near good enough to face blue eyes. Maybe if I got my rank up spell, that'd be cool. If I got my rank up spell, I could rank up into that one guy who lets me draw a card, the 3200 guy who can't be targeted. This guy? No, not him. I am. This guy. This guy. Go chain 3800. That'd, that'd be fantastic, but nope. <laughs> no, that's fine. Because I'm thinking, I'm thinking that you might overextend. I'm hoping that you will. Like, you use this effect, pop this, maybe. Yep, yep, I thought, I thought you were going to go ahead and overextend, so you can go ahead and catch the strike. Ah, I knew you were gonna overextend. Oh, of course you have gospel. God damn it, I hate that card. Why is that a card? Shit, Konami. Why? Why would you make a revival card for fucking dragons? Like, are you on fucking crack? Oh my god. Wow. 
Wow, he overextended. That play was fine. It's just, you know, I had him. And of course, you can grab back your alternative. Like, I should just straight up quit. Like, I should just admit defeat. There's no fucking way. There's no fucking way in baby Christ that I'll be able to do this. <laughs> uh, I mean, at least I got my rank up card. I could have inter uninterrupted slumber his ass. I could. But he could always just block that. Better than nothing, I get to push summon two kaiju monsters and then get a search next turn. Like if now, this would be a good time as anything. I can still normal summon Sen, then use my revival, and then make a rank 8 play. So if he protects with, protects with destruction with gospel, does that mean that I not get my play? Yeah, yeah, then, then I get nothing. I lose good day, sir. Fucking gospel, man. Like that and melody, like those two cards need to get fucking hit for blue eyes. Like those two cards are stupid ones. I don't give two shits about the fucking blue eyes plays. Alternative, that's cute, that's nice. But gospel is fucking stupid and melody is fucking stupid. Both these cards are fucking stupid. Crazy thing is I've already started working on my balance prediction for next one. Like I'm already starting to look at cards, watch the format and all that, so. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I just wanna I just wanna special summon my gimmick puppet. Really, that's all I wanna do, so just need to summon another eight. Go into a rank eight play. I don't think I can game him. So there's really no point in me doing that play, so I think the best play that I have right now is actually ranking up into what's its face. Unless this is a solemn strike or something like that. Or it's a bottomless trap hole. Alright, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. This man had everything for my plays. Holy shit. I have to shit kick that at me. Alright, we'll get another duel, bear. Alright. Well, like, try to get another duel. Why Joe Pro crash? Open up Why Joe Pro. Why Joe Pro crash? Open up Why Joe Pro. Then I noticed, oh, it's crashing when I'm in the, uh, the USA server. I went to the, uh, I'm now in the Europeans. European server. Wow. Oh, this, this fucking, this opening hand though. Like, alright. <laughs> you know, but of the multiple pot of desires. <laughs> I'm throwing Reckless because it's a filler card. It's a card that I don't mind banishing with, uh, with pot of desires. But then, also, it's fun to get at multiples, you know. We've seen, we've seen time and time again that it's fun to get, so. I mean, I guess I can just go ahead and get set up, really. And getting set up would be fine. Did I banish both my other ones? No. So I wouldn't feel her. Well, that's all I'll go ahead and do. Maybe I'll draw into a second Reckless. Nope, double strike. Damn. Damn, double fucking strike, boys. I'll just set one. <laughs> Alright, but yeah, this class. And it, it seems so much similar to the third class, except it seems a little bit more. Like, I think I gotta visit a teacher for five hours. That's fine. School started, so that can be done by the end of the month. By the end of September, I think the class ends up September 24th. That can be done. Uh, outside of that, it's still two discussion posts per week. Instead of, wow, wow, he's gonna take the, the nag on the Twin Twister. See, this is the reason why I don't set multiples like that. I don't pitch the one for one, too. The reason why is because I don't want you to Twin Twister two of my cards. Like, that's this is totally, that's legitimately the reason. Yeah. So, go ahead and summon your Red Eyes Flare Dragon thing. Yep, clip him with the good good. Cause that card is good good. This guy's me. I mean, I should have known he's playing red. His name is straight up Joey Joey Wheeler. Like, come on. Yep, we'll go ahead and summon Feeler. Why not? Oh, there goes half my life points. Hopefully, I'll be able to do a uh, rank eight play this turn. It really depends. I don't want to set this because I was like twin twister, and then I thought maybe I could get something else. Yeah, yeah, I, I do have a rank 8 play. I, I really do. It's just... What do I do? And of course, as soon as I pop him, he can just go ahead. Like, this card is so stupid. Like, I think I'm gonna go ahead and summon, make these two an 8, go into Gimmick Puppet of Strings. I mean, Gimmick Puppet with this guy. Detach, pop. Yeah, detach, pop. Destroy him because he is special summon. He won't take any damage. This will get the search. I'll probably get Red Eyes Fusion. And then at least I have the, the Dogaram for that. But I, I don't know. I don't know. Facing Blue Eyes. I can't even. I'm fucking down Blue Eyes. I can't even be fucking Blue Eyes or Red Eyes. Like, come on. Like, this, this deck is not 
not anywhere near what it needs to be. I know I rank up card, but I didn't get it. So I probably banished them all because I banished like 20 of my cards. There's one, two, three. Yeah, I banished them all. Ugh. Uh, I said, sometimes I just don't know how I feel about, uh, about fucking, uh, pot, pot desires. It's, it's good. It's a plus one. It definitely is. Oh, wait, I can just do my, do my spider place. I can just do my spider place. So we're still good. I forgot about them. Totally forgot about them. So let me detach you, pop you. Oh, right. I forgot he gets banished when I detach him see material. Forgot about that. Yep, go ahead and get your red eyes fusion because get your own fucking I don't mean, know. Oh, insight will search you your fusion. The same thing. Can I only special summon gimmick puppets when I use this effect? Because it said that I could exceed and now exceed on top. No, I can't. Can I not? Can I only activate? Whoa, with two or more C materials. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Wow, I feel like a butt now. Did not know that. Fucking rip on that. Holy shit. Now I can actually set my back row. I don't think I have another twin twister. He took the neg on the twin twister, so. Because, you know, I actually have another solemn strike, but solemn, what the fuck is solemn strike gonna do against this fucking red eyes fusion, right? Like, I guess I could strike him. Wait, I can't activate anything till the end of the damage step, so I couldn't even, I can't even strike him at all. Like, ah, oh, I'm in deep shit. <laughs> yep, I am in deep shit. Or he could just throw the regeki at me. Yeah, that works. That works. Oh, I'm dead. I am definitely dead. And of course, gospel. Like, oh my god, why is that even a fucking card? Why? Fuck gospel. It works in red eyes, works in blue eyes, works in dragon rollers. Like, why'd you make this card, Konami? Like, I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. I am. I am. Son of a bitch, I'm dead. Like, of course. Of course. Just fucking throw the regeki at me and then attack. Like, wow, that wasn't even a good duel. That wasn't even a good duel. And of course, I can't strike shit, so. Ugh. Ugh. GG, I guess. Like, wow. Yeah, I could strike him and then I'll be at 100 life points left. Yeah, let's do that. I'll have 100 fucking life points. And then he could just protect from destruction. But at least I negated his effect, right? Yeah! You can play Insight, get your fucking search on, get fucking fusion, like. I might have to play Reckless. I might actually have to play Reckless. Yep, yep. Get your fucking helmet ass fusion on. Wow. Wow, I've literally done no damage to this man. Fucking Joey Wheeler, huh? I'm playing... I'm, I'm one of this fucking Zexel guy, right? That plays fucking gimmick puppets? Like, fucking ass, man. Ass. Ugh. Well. Oh. Definitely have to play Reckless. I have a choice on that. Who's activating in the graveyard? Oh, Jerry Doll. That's cool. So, I could do that play. Yeah, I don't think I need to activate Reckless right now. I can go ahead and do Doll. Summon. Oh, but no, he could just burn me. He could just burn me. Right, right, right. Oh, that's game. That's probably game. Then I, I need to activate Reckless. No, because never mind, because even if I get like a strike or something, it doesn't fucking matter because you could just. I can't play. I don't have the light points to play strike. He'll just burn me, so. Yep, that's game. You know what? At least I can just bust out my, my cool spider. Yeah, at least that can be done. Wow, losing the red eyes too. I mean I mean losing the blue eyes, that's a fucking game. That's that's a that's a top tier meta deck. But losing the red eyes, like come on. Come on, man. Like, wow. At least I can do some fucking damage up in this bitch. Wow. Wow. Woo! Gimmick puppets, they're so good. Oh wait, no they're not. <laughs> they're really not. Uh, I think the spider will actually be really good. I mean, really strong, because it's like the difference in our life points, right? It's defense. Oh, it's all the XC monsters. I was thinking of the other spider. No, oh, I was thinking of the other spider. God damn it. I was thinking of that really good spider. So, why does card seem material? He's telling me about it. What's your detach? I think it's like, detach seem material, destroy, yeah, to open card. Destroy all face up monsters your opponent controls. Defense less than or equal to this card defense. So yeah, I could activate my effect and then pop your blue eyes and then hit you directly for uh four thousand. But then you could just go red eyes fusion, fucking fusions from the deck, because that's totally fucking fair. Go into your fucking uh, meteor and then just send a dragon send a red eye burn me for game, so Yep. Yep. 
So at least I did some damage to you. Shit. But yeah, the class, the course, just seems like same. Seems exactly like the same uh, course three. Except a little bit more. He changed some things though. And course three, there was a discussion board. There's still a discussion board in five. But instead of you post and then you reply to two students, he would like like Professor Daniel was always on the ball. He would always reply to you no matter what. But you didn't have to reply to him. You just had to reply to other students, so he'd pretty much be posting for the sake of posting. Now he's changed it. Now you post, then he replies to your post, and you have to reply to his post. So you don't reply to other students, but you have to reply to his post. Because I guess he thinks that uh, what he his input is more important than the other students' input. So I guess that's game. GG. 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 Go ahead and burn me. Go ahead and burn me. Oh, wow. Throw in fucking Sparkfield too? Don't go ahead and throw in Sparkfield too? Like, I, don't, I don't know that's how you're gonna beat me. You're gonna burn me. Like, we already know. It's fucking, it's fucking Red Eyes. It's really hard to respect Red Eyes and... I mean, it's like, oh, it's Joey. Like, that's cool, but Red Eyes is just a sacky ass burn deck. Like, it's really what it is. So many of the cards burn. I think I'll OTK to burn you because there's so much burn. And yeah. Burn, 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 burn. <laughs> I have 100 life points left. I have the strong amounts. I have a 4,000 beater. I seriously doubt there's anything in his deck that he can summon to attack over this. It's 4,000 beater. But he can just burn me. <laughs> so, the session board is a little bit easier. There's still two assignments per week, two discussion boards, and, you know, the additional help. Wow, okay. I thought, I thought, I thought you were going to do Red Eye Fusion and burn me. Okay. Did you not have the targets in your deck for Red Eyes Fusion? Is that it? Barkfield, so other Red Eyes monsters you control cannot destroy battle by card effects. Okay. So I just destroy you. Like, I thought you were just gonna burn me. I thought you were gonna Red Eyes Fusion, send, send, summon Red Eyes, send another Red Eyes with your Red Eyes Fusion. Like, I don't know what you're doing, Joey. Joey, you're being weird. You are being weird right now. You can go Sparkfield and you can get rid of this, try and pop this, but. I need this is a tactic signature to protect myself from being destroyed, so. And then you leave yourself wide open for a direct another 4,000 for game. Like, I'm seriously trying to figure out what the fuck you're doing. I know you have a Red Eyes Fusion, and then the other card, I think is a... Is it a Red Eyes? This one of this? I think it's a Flare. Because, yeah, it's a Red Eyes Fusion and a Flare. Wow. 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 Okay, so why, why you no play Red Eyes Fusion? So, I could just use my effect, right? I can just banish, detach the materials, banish as many special monsters your opponent controls, but will then attach this to the material on the banished monsters. I see material, the physical cover. Yeah, I can just do that and then attack you directly for 4,000. Like, wow, dude. Seriously? Wow. Yummy. Attack her again, GG. Like, wow. All you had to do was Red Eyes Fusion. And then fuse like you must have not been able to do red eye fusion. That must have been a thing, cause that would just went red eye fusion, go into your fucking meteor guy, the fucking the thirty five hundred guy, sent to red eyes, burn me for half the damage game. All right, all right. Anyway, we're done, people. So more work, more homework. Uh, I already ordered the book off of fucking Amazon. I could have got the the book for a penny and then three ninety nine shipping, but. I need the book as soon as possible. If I would have did that way, then I wouldn't have got my Amazon Prime because I've been ordering it through a secondhand shop, which of course means that the shipping would have took all the way until like next week, and I've got assignments due this week that I need the book for, so rip on that. So I had to order the book from Amazon for like $8, Amazon Prime, free two-day two shipping. So I'll be getting that book soon, and it's all on the homework, so shit. Never left, so welcome back to school, people. Uh, you know, uh... If you want to go ahead, comment section below and tell me how your first day going back to school, if you're going back to school, went, you know. Like, I'm already back in it, class five, and yay, I get, like, a fucking one day off, one day off of not, not stressing out about school until right back in it, so. Not only that, but I'm going to have to go and visit my uh, teachers from high school again, at least for five hours. We got a handful of interview questions, then we got, like, eight, so... Just take all the interview eight question, interview questions, go in there one day, sit there for literally one day, go through like, what is it? I think it's like four classes. I gotta be in there for five hours. And I think class is an hour and a half. So hour and a half, three hours, four hours, 30 minutes. Yep, yeah, six hours. So I gotta be in there for four classes. Be in there for four classes, interview my professor, I mean, my professor, my teacher, 
get that done. Get all those done, because like I said, there's two per week, it's eight. Um, do the, of course, do the two assignments, the two discussions, like, it, it's it's a lot. It's a lot of work. Like, it's it's literally the, same, the class three, except throw on some more work. It, it seems like that's how it's been. Like, you just keep on stacking more shit on top of shit. Like, this class right here is really, really similar to class four. Like, everything is the same exact, exact same as class four, except the except the the five hours that, that's new but the interview your professor eight questions that was in class four the two assignments per week that was in class four the two discussions per week that was in class four so anyway i'm done i'm done <laughs> so i hope that you guys enjoyed this episode i done it all so i gave my purpose or just and i said i wanted to try out pot desires i didn't need pot desires but i was like oh there's a lot of cards at three it's a more aggressive card it's a really strong card let me go ahead and play it you know as long as i can play fail cards like upstart maxis uh reckless greed you know i can play it because you know most majority of the time how tcg players feel it's like oh well, you know i'm only playing 40 cards i don't want i'm playing not to lose so i don't want to deck myself out <laughs> just play some filler shit like i might be doing a discussion on it maybe maybe I don't know, it depends. I'm still not, no no news on uh, next great YouTuber, so I'm not sure if I made it in or not. Uh, I haven't heard anything about that, but if I do, then, yeah. I'm assuming, especially with the, the kind of judges they are, I mean, Simo, freaking Nim Nim, and Arnisker, like, there's probably gonna be a discussion part, so I'm still, I'm trying to, you know, jog on my brain and think about what I want to discuss, you know, so. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Of course, I'll be back tomorrow. So thanks for watching. Thanks for the support. And I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching.